Hello everyone. Today we are going to tell you how to program a Roger gate motor. Now this motor we are connected already with the power and we make one jumper from common to FT1. Uh, if you, when you're going to install the motor, so there you have to connect a common wire here, photocell, and the signal wire will be here. So in the meantime, we are not connected the photocell and we make a jumper from common to FT1. So first of all, you have to do this. And after that, you will check your uh, motor direction. So for that, you have to go with the, in the logic state and that you have to select from here, 7101. So first you have to select 7101 and here this one is 7101 and now this if you have a 01 if you stand at inside your house so your motor will be on right side if your motor gate is opening on right side you should keep it on 01 and if your motor is on left side you have to bring here with this selecting 00 and you leave it uh, for one or two seconds so it will be stable and this is now memorized so now your motor is set on left side left side opening after that you if you, uh, you have to set closing time if you like so closing time you will set you have to bring here 21 by pressing this buttons and when it will be on 21 so we now selected we change this default this default time is 30 second so this is 30 second if you like to increase more you can select from here but now we will set on default and this is 30 second so we'll have to leave same time like this and we have to leave it until it be memorized so now it's memorized now you have to program you have to close your gate completely and lock this motor and from here you come like this now we are telling you how to pro program auto set so you have to press it this long for a long time it will appear here ap like this you have to leave it and then you press it again the motor will start running and this is going now to open the gate so once the gate is open you have to uh, switch the limit switch first so we have pressed now this and it will be now stop and now it's again closing the gate now it's closing the gate and we have to press it we have to push this button again so it will stop so this is now your motor is programmed now you can test it it is already programmed now so while you normally start the gate will be open and in next video we are going to tell you how to program the remote